Hey, it's Jake Mace with Phoenix Longevity Arts. We had some requests for the eight traditional Qigong postures, sometimes called the eight brocades of Chinese Qigong. So let's do it right now. We're gonna interlock our fingers, have our stance be shoulder width, and uh, if you're watching, get up and try with me. Okay. Breathe in and stretch the arms toward the sky. And I'm balancing on the ball of my foot, but you can always go flat-footed if you're a beginner. Exhale, push the arms down, isometrically contracting in a pushing down motion. I do this about three to five times. The speed of the movements is dictated by the breathing. So inhale. Exhale. Let's just do one more. Inhale. Exhale. The next one is twisting the back side to side. So stepping out to a wider horse stance width. Put the arms down on the legs, pushing the knees out. Notice how my thighs are flat and my toes are pointed pretty much to the front. I'm gonna turn to the left and breathe in. And I'm stretching my shoulder and my lower back. And turn to the right and breathe out. Turn to the left, breathe in. Turn back, breathe out. Okay, two more times. One. And exhale. Stretch those hips, push your knees out. And two, breathe in. And breathe out. and come back to your original position. Up and down. Number three, we're gonna isometrically contract our body as if we're pushing down and up at the same time. So fingertips together, step to our wider stance, breathe in, and when your hands reach your solar plexus, one palm goes up, one palm goes down. Adding the heel lift for extra balance training and exhale, drop down. Other side, same thing. Exhale. Two more times, in. Hold the breath in for a brief hold and then exhale. Really using the entire diaphragm, again. Now, all right, one more. Breathe in. And out. Breathe in. Breathe out. And back. The next posture is very classical. It's called drawing the bow left and right. So from this position, I'm gonna step out to a wider stance, bring my arms around, and I'm going to push down as hard as I can as I exhale. Pull my right arm back as I inhale. Drop down again, exhale. Seek your stance, other side. Pull back left. Breathe out. Other side, breathe in. Use your legs. This is about building power and rooting as well as leg strength. Right arm back. Use your back muscles. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Come back up again. And down. Posture five is very similar to one and three with a little bit of a difference. We're gonna step out to our shoulder width stance again. And this time, kinda like number one, but the hands are overlapped and we're gonna inhale and push those hands up toward the sky. 
This time, we're gonna exhale and drop down and stretch as low as we can. With the neck straight. Then keep your hands down, breathe in, and look up, strengthening your neck. And hold the breath in for a brief hold. Exhale, back up again. Let's do three more. Breathe in, balance. Breathe out, sink. Breathe in, look up. Breathe out, return. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. Last one, in. Exhale. Inhale. And exhale. The next posture, we step out to shoulder width again. Put your palms forward, and if you have really good balance and you feel pretty athletic, then lift your heels up and balance on the ball of your foot. If you don't, then you can stay flat-footed. And we're gonna keep our legs as stationary as we can and breathe in and turn to the left. Hold the breath for a brief hold. Breathe out, return. So we're using core action, stomach muscles and lower back, and balance. Turn again, breathe in. out. Again, breathe in. Breathe out. One more. Breathe in. Breathe out. Nice. That one is so relaxing. And drop the arms down. It's starting to feel good now. <clears throat> The next posture is kind of strange, but it works a lot of vibrational tension in the body. We're gonna be looking to the left, stepping out to the left, breathing in, breathing out and sinking. Now using pulsating muscle tension as we breathe in, and then breathe out. This direction, in. Out. Breathe in. Turn, 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 and push with the arms. Breathe out. Breathe in. And out. Again, breathe in. Breathe out. Other direction, in. And out. Last one, in. Notice my stance rising, and then exhale and sinking. Breathe in, and out. And the last posture is done at the end of the set, but it's also a posture that I do about five to 10 times a day, about five or 10 breaths per time. And it's a posture that will invigorate the body with oxygen. Oxygen is life. so. You can go days without water, weeks without food, but only minutes without oxygen. So let's try it together. Stepping out to shoulder width, dropping the arms down. And it's just about filling your lungs and shaking any kind of stress, tension, anger, conflict out of your body back into the earth. Breathing in. Breathing out. And just let the body relax. Breathe in. Blow it out. Relax. Three more. Nice. Breathing in. Positive thoughts. Last one. Good. And then we are finished with the traditional eight set of Chinese Qigong called the Eight Brocades of Qigong. Replay this video and try each posture for five or 10 breaths apiece, and consistent practice on a daily basis is key.